welcome back. Today I have for you a video on how to organize a small closet, a New York City closet to be exact. And let me tell you guys, these are extremely tiny, especially for someone as a fashion blogger and has a lot of clothes. But I'm just going to be showing you guys some of my tips and tricks recently to organize it better and have more space. Every time I organize my closet, I like to take out everything and start from scratch, and that's what I'm doing right now. P.S. I really wish I could have done that that quickly because let me tell you, it took me forever, but now I'm just cleaning off the floor, and that's what it should look like. So previously, I put two bars across from each side, like so. Before, I only had one, and I feel like two definitely makes more space for you to put more clothes. And then I just have to get rid of all that stuff up there, but I'll do that later. And now I'm focusing on the middle, but that's what all the mess looks like, guys. I have to organize all that clothes. But now, onto what I need. We need 16 brackets for the wooden shelves. Then some screws. A hammer and a screwdriver I would totally recommend for you guys to use a drill and you're going to see why in a few but I got four big shelves from Home Depot I custom made these according to the length and width of my closet and four small ones that go right in the middle you're going to see exactly how it's going to look in a few but now I'm just putting the brackets on the wood to make it easier I'm just putting some tape across and doing it like the good old days by hand but I'm telling you guys a drill is going to make it so much easier and way less painful and then I actually realized that my screws were a little bit too small for my wood so I have to go back and get longer ones because that's what happened so make sure you get the right size for your wood and then I'm just putting the same thing all over again some tape across and putting the brackets on each side by the way if you're wondering where there's a Christmas tree in the back it's because I filmed this early December So if you're wondering why I said to get a drill, here's why. I honestly regret it so much, but this is what it should look like. Just two brackets on each side of the wood. To make it a little bit more precise, I'm using a pencil and marking where I want my shelves, but then I just decided to use a box, that way I could just put it on top, especially if you're doing it by yourself, I think this is a great option. And then I'm just screwing the screws by hand. By the way, I finally found some use out of my gym gloves because that's how bad my hands were getting. So that's what it should look like. It's definitely not perfect. I would totally recommend for you guys to paint it. That way it looks nicer, but I just, you know, I wanted to do it really quick and easy for you guys. Now here is the before. After, I decided to use three boxes on the top for my knitting, socks, and scarf, and also my luggage is all the way in the back. Then that's what the bottom looks like. Again, if you use one color of hangers, that also makes it a little bit more organized. And then for the small shelves that I have in the middle, I actually wanted to put shoes, but then I just decided to put sweater since it is winter. All the way in the back, I have my Halloween stuff, and this closet organizer came so in handy. I got a lot, lot less, and it doesn't really look too organized, but definitely helps. And then that's what the bottom part looks like. I put some shoes, some folded clothes, some more boxes to store more things. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let me know in the comments below if it was helpful and if you want to see more. Subscribe if you haven't done so already, and see you next time. Bye!